Hey guys, welcome back to this 20 threat MCP battle report. Uh, but before we get into the list, I'd like to thank I ask everybody to hit the like, subscribe, notification button. Really does help the channel grow, and I'd like to thank everybody who's done so already. Also, team up with my local game store, Recess Games. Click the link below. Uh, go into their e store, buy anything in the store that you want. They'll ship it right to the house. It does not have to be 40K. I'm sorry, not 40K. Well, they'll have to be 40K related either, but it does not have to be MCP related. Um, any, like I said, anything in the store. On checkout, hit the promo code MONSTER, all caps MONSTER, get 10% off your purchase. If you don't have a local game store, please use mine. With all that being said, let's get into the list. Bringing a new Doc Ock. I want to see how he is today. Uh, you saw a spider foes. So we got Doc Ock, we have Kingpin, we have Venom, we have Rhino, and we have Green Goblin. The cards I'm going to play are going to be This Is Our Day, uh, Well Blade Out Plan, This Is a Robbery, Patch Up and Brace for Impact. That's my 20 threat. Let's go take a look at the X-Men. All right, guys, before we get into it, my buddy Kevin's back. What's up? If you guys remember, Kevin was my, uh, my first loss, dude. Yeah, yeah, first loss <laughs> on the channel. All right, so here, we, here we go. What would you bring us to? All right, so we got uh, 20, uh, all X-Men. Uh, we're going with Cyclops Leadership. We got Psylocke, uh, Storm, Cable, and then Logan uh, the Wolverine. Okay. Uh, as far as cards, we're going Patch Up. First Class, Children of the Atom, Crimson Dawn, and then Timmy, my X-Men. All right, we'll be back with the mission and deployment. All right, guys, we are back after the uh, deployment. So the cards we drew were uh, Riot Sparks, uh, Rod Sparks, Extremists, or Extreme, yeah, Extremists. So we have, um, basically, that's going to be represented by the blue tokens, which are covered up by these reds here. And we pick those up, or I'm sorry, we secure the, count, the councils, and as long as we're within range two, we get a power. And then uh, scrolls infiltrate. infiltrate. Uh, that's we pick one of those up. We can only hold one. We roll our defensive dice, and if we get a crit or a wild, we um, if we don't get a crit, or, right? Yeah, if you don't get a crit. If you don't get a crit or a wild, you get moved. And uh, so I'm going to be represented by the red token, and Kevin's going to be represented by the blue token. He did get priority. Oh, deployments real quick. So basically just set up. Goblin's going to go up that way. Uh, Doc Ock's going to go that way. And whatever happens here up the middle, because that seems to be where we got to get one of those tokens. The, the board we play, we're playing right now is we have threes. The two bodegas are threes. We're actually going to play the comic book shop as a three as well. The grocery store is a four. Josie's is a five. We're going to play the broken station as a three as well. The cars are all going to be twos. The dumpsters are twos. And everything else on the board is going to be ones. These billboards, we start a new month. Um, they are not interactive train. You can throw people into them, but you can't move them. Uh, these are for members. And this week, this month's member I uh, was drawn was Greg Gonzalez. So, Greg, I don't know if you watch the MTP stuff. I know you do watch 40K stuff. Um, but I want to continue the monster movie theme. And uh, put King Kong on that. This is Greg. He was pulled, so he'll be featured on my bat reps on MCP and 40K for the rest of the month. And then I will send this to you, Greg, at the end of the uh, at the um, and it will. I'll send it in the new year for January. It just now belongs to you if you want it. Uh, we'll just we'll somehow get in contact with you. Uh, put the comment comment sometime below, and I'll send you my email address for this, or just email me because it's on the site anyway. But it is for members. If you take a minute, um, check the link below. It does talk about the memberships and what and how we and the different tiers and how we go about finding this and getting. And, and I appreciate the support for the, those who have already signed up as members. Um, and this is just my way of this is just my way of showing that. So, uh, what'd you do as far as the planet goes? Um, so we got uh, most of my heavy hitters right up the middle here. Um, we got Wolverine over by himself because uh, for on the hunt and get on my head, we kind of want to keep him sequestered. And then Storm is over here, um, probably trying to get up on top of the building. Uh, obviously, she's got flight, so that's no problem for her. Mm -hmm. uh, and we're just going to kind of see again what happens in the middle with uh, with all the, with uh, <laughs> the scrum that's going to happen. I'm sure. <laughs> exactly. Uh, leadership. You're playing Scots. Yes. For those who don't know, what is Scots leadership? So uh, whenever one of my uh, allied characters deals damage. Uh, as long as they um, they can give one power to any character that was in range five of the character that dealt damage. Gotcha. And so then, they're just kind of spreading power around. 
Gotcha. And then my, I'm going to use uh, Doc Cox, um, new new leadership. And what that is basically, it's once um, I get damaged, I get. I'll just read it just so it's easier. Uh, once per turn after it, that, after an attack targeting an ally character is resolved, that character, if that character is not dazed, it gains one power. Additionally, once per turn, when an ally character suffers damage from the attack, it gets to shake a shock, incinerate, or slow condition as well. Um, so that's actually pretty good. Actually, it's really good, in my opinion. But uh, all right, so uh, Kevin did get priority, and you get to go first, sir. All right. Uh, so we're going to start out with Wolverine, uh, Logan. He's just going to move up. And oh, I'm sorry. Um, real quick, before I am going to play, um, uh, uh, first class. Mm -hmm. uh, so none of my X Men characters will have to pay to interact with their first interaction. Um, so again, he's just going to double move. He'll get within one of the point, and then he will pick up uh, the first senator. All right. And that'll be Wolverine done. Okay, well, I think what we're going to have to do is go with uh, Goblin, who does have flight. So I'm just going to get him there. And here, I just get him up top of here, and I'll spend the power and pick this up. Okay. Uh, we have to both roll to see if we move. Oh, right. Okay. Uh, so Wolverine uh, does get the wild, so he's good. All right. And then uh, Green Goblin has four, four physical and do not. So okay. So does get the move. You can get the move him. All right. Moving short. Uh, we're actually going to bring him. Well, no, actually, we're going to put him back. I'm going to plop him down there. There, the goblin's done. All right. Um, we're going to go with... <laughs> Gosh, we're going to go with Cyclops. This year, like, no one wants to move up and get it. Can't, I know, can't right? Take the first hit. <laughs> go with Cyclops. Uh, first move. And then, again, he was just going to stop within two... Or, sorry, within one. Mm -hmm. uh, and again, doesn't have to pay to pick up. Which is super nice. Yeah, and that is Scott Dunn. So I don't know if I can get Venom over there. But I'm going to go with Venom. Oh, yeah, you yeah, got it. Yeah, yeah. Got it. I'm going to get Venom here within that one. Oh, we, we got to roll again. Oh, right. Keep forgetting. Yep, yep, yep. Roll in the middle box, please. Okay. So Cyclops, again, has four defense. Uh, gets He's the wilds. Good. He's good. All right, Venom. Four defense as well. Nothing. He gets moved. Wow. Well. All right. Apparently, spider foes are going to be moving all over the place. Uh, I want to keep you off that point. So let's just go there. All right. And Venom is done. All right, let's put the hurt into Venom then. Um, cable. First move, and then... Uh, oh, yeah, okay. So he's going to do a uh, plasma rifle into Venom. Uh, this is going to be five dice energy. Okay. Venom's weakest, I believe. Only got two energy. Yeah. All right, so three. And incinerate? Uh, it is incinerate, yes. Uh, save nothing. Okay. So it takes three. Take although, three and let me see. incinerate. Let me pause this for one second. All right, guys, so real quick. Uh, so Venom took three damage. Got three power, but because of Doc's ox, uh, Doc Ox ability, his leadership, so Venom gains an extra power because I was attacked, and be, and I and he did get the trigger off for Incinerate, so Incinerate would happen after the attack was resolved, 
But then since his happens first because of our operations, Doc Ock's also ability, he gets to remove once per turn, incinerate slow or stun, I think it was. Um, so I'm just going to remove the incinerate from Cable's attack off of Venom. Okay. Um, and because Cable did damage, uh, I now get to give power to someone within five, so I'm going to give it to Psylocke. And that'll be Cable done because he moved and attacked. And that was from Psylocke's leadership. Or, I'm sorry, that's from Cyclops. Yeah, Cyclops' leadership. So two leaderships just happened on that attack that were just getting power all over the place. All right, so Rhino. I think I'm just going to move up uh, twice here. Just get behind this building and secure that with uh, Kingpin. Okay. Uh, and I'm going to do very similar with Storm. Move and yeah, all right, and so she will be up there to contest that point. And so you own that point. Well, own yeah, secure that point. Yeah, so Doc Ock, I think that you went already. Um, let's do this. Let's just get Rhino. Let's get Rhino into the fray. Double move them. Okay. So he gets right up there. And then uh, he's done. All right. <coughs> All right. So Psylocke is up. Uh, and she will move. And then she's going to use her short to get up there so that she is on top, but uh, taking the point. Okay. And then uh, the last thing is going to be Dr. Octopus, who can move up. And we'll just, well, let's do this. All right, guys, here's what we're going to do. We're going to actually, uh, on my second activation, I'm not going to run up and get the point. I just don't want to take any hits from Wolverine right now. So what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to do striking tentacles, and that's going to be five attacks. Um, now we'll do the laser. We'll do the laser. Now we'll do striking sentinels. Five attacks, uh, and each wild is going to count as two successes. Okay. In the, and this is physical. Uh, so I got one crit. So I'm hitting three times. Three times? Okay. And the crit. Nice. Block and save them all. All right. And uh, so nothing. And Doc Ock is done. Okay. That's right. the end of round. So at the end of the turn, uh, you you had party. So what, what did you score for? Uh, so I got two senators and two points. Uh, so I'm getting four points total. And you're a blue player? Yep. And I got uh, two points and two senators. So I'm getting four as well. Yep. Right, one, two. No, I don't have two points. I have one point. I'm only getting three. Oh, that's right. Oh, yeah, because we're yeah, because we're moving. contesting. Okay, one. and you moved me off of this one. Yep. All right, we'll be back after the uh, power phase. All right, guys, we are back after the power phase. So, uh, real quick, um, with uh, Riot Spark, basically, if we're by this blue, I think I might have said it wrong. We don't get a power. We remove a damage if we're within two by the blue in the power-up phase, so that's what we got going on. All right, uh, so first up off the bat is going to be Cable, um, and he is going to, uh, first of all, spend two to do his uh, body slide by one. Mm -hmm. And then he is going into um, Venom with his uh, plasma uh, rifle. And it is... Uh uh, this is five dice energy. Energy, that's what I need to know. Uh, I am within three, so you can clap back if you want. But uh, since I'm within three, I can reroll two of my dice on the attack roll. Okay. Ooh, and thank goodness. Got <laughs> nothing. It's pretty good for me. All right, so one, one hit. Uh, saved you it. You saved it. Okay. All right, and we will clap back. Okay. So we will um, spend. We'll spend two for 
so many so many treats or so many snacks. And then what we're going to do is we're going to spend three for We Are Venom. And we are going to roll seven dice, and each damage you suffer, I remove a wound. Okay. So that's going to be seven tags. Uh, six, seven. Physical. Okay. And these <laughs> cannot be modified. Yeah, I would do uh, I would do technical telekinetic shield, but since I cannot modify my... I'm going to re-roll this crit rope. Whoop. It's got to be in the box. All right, so hitting five times. Or four times, four times. sorry. That's not one. Okay. Uh, blocking none. All right, so six four damage, Oof. and that will heal Venom the full full health. All right, uh, all right, we got to try it again. So we're going for the same plasma rifle, uh, five dice energy. Hopefully, roll a little better this time. Oh, that's better. All right, that's better. <laughs> I mean, you can't argue with four hits out of five. Yeah. Um, Reroll the one for my, uh, because I'm within three. Okay, so that's takes four. So it takes four. All right. So we're going to take, I mean, I guess it was a fair trade, right? Yep. You literally damaged me once. Um, take, I'm going to go up to five power. I'm just going to spend, I'm going to spend this exact same five again. That five power I just got, we're going to do the exact, exact same thing, unless I can only do that once per turn. I can only do so many snacks once per turn. So. Okay. Uh, and that's going to be, actually, um, uh, all right, so I'm going to spend three uh, to do Omega level threat. Uh, and we're going to throw this uh, bodega here. Um, has to be within uh, within three, which it certainly is. Oh, yeah. And he's throwing it medium. So, yeah, I'm throwing it right into. And we'll just spend the one for grace. Okay. So that's off the board now. Go ahead and is... burn that card. <laughs> Alrighty. All right. And that's going to be cable done. All right. Well, looks like I'm going to have to activate Venom because he's only got. Uh, so I do get. So you hit me. Five, you hit me four times, right? Yeah. I did get one for Doc, for Doc Ox power. That's why I got five power. I do get incinerated on one of those attacks, I believe. Yeah, but then and Doc Ox re removed it. Removes it. So that's kind of what happened on that whole that whole sequence. And um, I think what we're gonna have to do is do Venom, and we're going to. Let me pause this for one second. All right, guys, I'm going to activate Venom because um, I just think we need to <laughs> we need to make sure that he stays alive. So I'm going to do I'm within three Cyclops. So I'm going to do uh, I'm going to spend two for I'm going to spend three for We Are Venom. And I'm going to do that first. So it's going to be seven dice in the Cyclops. Let's see if I can get any. See if I can get any uh, power back here. Uh, so I explode one crit. So I'm only hitting uh, three times or four times. Okay. And I'm spending two to do quick draw on Cyclops. Okay. So I'm rolling five dice. Uh, if I manage to take no damage from this, uh, Venom will take two damage. Okay. I split the crit. Only blocking one. All right, so I'm taking three. And so I don't get power for that, but I do remove that three. And then what I'll do is, uh, then I'm going to uh, send me a tentacles into him, and it's going to be five dice. Okay. And he'll gain the bleed condition. All right. Uh, that's pretty good. So I'm going to hit uh, five times. Oof. All right. Uh, blocking two. So taking three. 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 And that will, uh, that will daze him. All right. Venom is done. All right. Uh, so this will come out. Oh. All right. We're going to go with Logan. Uh, and he is within three of Doc. <laughs> um, so we're going to do X slash into Doc Ock. Okay. Uh, this will be five dice physical. 
I don't think I can find out if I have grace on this. Can I? I'll do it again. On this attack? Yeah, uh, from me. I don't know if I can reach Oh, anything. I don't think yeah. I can. Okay. Uh, does have a pierce on a wild. Uh, a pierce on. So I got two. All right, so I'm going to save it with the explosion. Yep. Right. Um, and then I get to place within one of you. That's the whole objective. Yep. Yeah. Oh yeah, you're good. All right. Uh, and then he's gonna do it again. All right. Need a good save from Doc Ock again. Ooh, that's pretty uh, good. Three with a pierce. Uh, so you're gonna pierce, gonna pierce that, that once. So it's gonna take three. Take three. Of them. Okay. And I don't believe Doc Ock can help himself. So. But it says an allied character, and he is not. Okay, uh, and that'll be Wolverine done because he attacked twice. Already. All right, guys, we're gonna do. Uh, go we're gonna go with Goblin, and I'm going to go into Storm, and it's going. I'm gonna Pumpkin Bomber, so I get um, Pumpkin Bomb gets five dice. Oh yeah. Okay. And then, uh, yeah, and then any wilds she's going to get incinerated or bleed or poison. Uh, got the wild off. Can't re roll any of these, so I hit twice. Okay. Uh, rolling three for defense. Uh, block two. Them. Okay. But before damage is dealt, she'll be incinerated. Incinerated, okay. And, um,. I, I didn't get any power I wanted to get the hit and run off. So, what I think, I'm, uh, yeah, she saved him, right? Because she's, she's yeah. got cover. I think what we'll do is, um, yeah, I think I'll just fly up there and contest that point. Okay. And he'll be done. All right. I'm going to actually bring him down here. So, it makes it a little bit harder for Cyclops, <laughs> Psy Psylocke to get. Sure. All right. Uh, so we're going to clap back with Storm here. Uh, we're going to spend... Uh, actually, first we're going to uh, do Turn of the Atom. Uh, so she removes the incinerate and gains mm -hmm. a power. Uh, and then we will spend uh, two for Eye of the Storm. Uh, on her next attack, she adds two dice to the attack. Um and she will do her um, lightning. Uh, actually, what's Doc Ox? Uh, green Goblin. Yeah, or sorry, Green Goblin. Uh, four, four, three, three, three. three. Okay, yeah. So she's going to do her um, lightning bolt into Green Goblin. All right. Uh, so there's no really four dice, adding two, so it's going to be a five dice attack. Or, six. I'm sorry, six dice attack. And on a wild, you will be shocked. Mm. All right, pretty good. So fourth is wild. Only saving one. So okay, taking two. Uh, taking three. Here's I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm sa yep, saving one of them. So yeah. I'm take take three damage. Take three. You will be shocked, but obviously you can remove that with yep. uh, Doc Ock's ability. So I'm right. taking three and then getting an extra extra power. Ah, that's pretty good. All right, and then um. She is going to spend the four uh, to do Hurricane. Uh, okay. This is her <clears throat> area attack. Uh, it's going to be six dice physical. Uh, and uh, after the attack is resolved, uh, any characters with flight superpower um, also take an additional one damage. Okay. This is uh, energy again? Uh, this is physical. Oh, all right. Mm -hmm. Only doing two. Saving one. Okay. So I'm going to take two damage because I'm damage. a flight. Yep. And Doc Ock's ability is only once per turn, so I cannot do that again. All right. And unfortunately, no one is within five of her to give out any power, so uh, that'll be Storm done. Attacking twice. All right. Um, I think I'm going to move a kingpin. Just going to move up. All right, guys. So I'm going to move up. 
I'm going to grab that for one. Off the wrong guy. And then I'm going to roll my defensive dice, which is four. Uh, did get the wild off so he doesn't get moved. And then I'm going to keep in this draw back here again within range. One of this. And Kingpin's done. All right. <laughs> got, I got the world's uh, most expensive objective for <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, well, unfortunately, all Betsy's going to do is stand on the point because uh, I can't really afford to come off of that and lose the points. So that's unfortunately all she's going to do. All right. So we'll have Rhino go into uh, Wolverine here. Okay. So first we're going to gore. So that's going to be five dice. Because I can't stampede or anything. And just twice. Okay. Uh, Save it blocking. And we're going to do it again. Uh, three times three? that time. Okay. Let's uh, nice crit. Black and three. All right. Look at this guy. <laughs> then, uh, then what we'll do is we'll take his two. His two power. It's going to be a waste, but hey, you know what? We won't. We'll just take Doc Ock, who's medium, and I think what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to. I'm going to bring Doc Ock back here. And we're going to switch this off a little bit. Smart. And Doc's done. So at the end of the turn, you had priority. So what did you score? Uh, I'm just taking the one point here and uh, one senator for two points. All right. So that's six. And I got three senators, four, and that's it. So okay. I'm going to go up to seven. Okay. And we're in round three. All right. All right, guys. We'll be back after the power-up phase. All right, guys, we're back after the power up phase. So real quick, two, two corrections um, that I want to, not really corrections, but interactions that we did just to make up for a couple things. Um, the, after his, after Green Goblin's, uh, his activation, because I'm within one of the, um, the council, I did spend the power to heal him a wound. And once I moved Doc Gok over here, I also spent one power to heal him a wound as well. Uh, that I was on the impression it happened at the end of the round, but it didn't. So Kevin was gracious enough to let me do that. Let me do that as if it was my turn. So let me remove these and you were up, sir. All right. Um, so we are going to, um, go with, uh, Cyclops first. Uh, he is going to pay, uh, two to do hit and run. Mm-hmm. So that, and I'm like sliding this up perfectly for you. <laughs> um, so he is going to uh, go into. Um, actually, can you go into? We're gonna go into Venom. Probably not the best choice, but I want Venom out. So, uh, so he's gonna do Optic Blast. This uh, is uh, five dice energy. Energy. Yeah. Uh, just two. Save one. Okay. Takes one. Take one. Takes one. Uh, gets power. Gets another power from Doc Ock. Uh, in condition on this? Uh, no, I did not get the wild, so there's okay. no push. All right, so I guess we'll spend the two for uh, we'll spend the two for for uh, so many snacks, and we'll go into Cyclops. Okay. With uh, see if I can get that back. I'll actually spend five, and we'll do. We are venom, so we'll get to roll seven dice on this again. Okay, and I'm gonna spend two for a quick draw. Oh, that was huge. Oh, jeez. Oh, that was huge. Oh my gosh, that was a sick roll right there. So uh, it's seven. Seven. Up. Okay. Blocking one. 
So taking six. Taking six, he's out. Oh, that's pretty bad. That's low. horrible. That's horrible. And then he'll venom will heal up. All right. Uh, well, unfortunately, that's Cyclops done because he's <laughs> dead. So, um, well, I guess what we'll do is. Oh wait, he didn't go. That was. Nope. I'm gonna go with Rhino. Okay. And I'm gonna play. Uh, I'm gonna spend three. I'm gonna play. Uh, this is a robbery. And I'm gonna basically throw Wolverine. Uh, let's see. Uh, spend two two power. And uh, choose an enemy char character within one, and if that character is holding, it drops drops objective, and then I get to throw you a medium. So we are going to throw him. Um, I'm going to throw him. I want to stay within range, so because it really doesn't matter, <laughs> I'll throw him into. I'll throw him just straight. Back this way. Okay. In the billboard. Into the billboard. Okay. So he just takes. Oh, so one he just damage. takes one. Yeah. Okay. And then uh, I'll she'll drop the token. All right. I'll spend my one and pick it up. And then I roll my three physical defense. Uh, and I do get moved, so you do get the movement. Okay. Uh, we right back there. All right, so then what we'll do is, it actually did save, save uh, from him getting an attack. All right, so then I'm going to attack into him with Gore. Okay. So that was his first activation. Gore is five dice going into Wolverine. Uh, just one. Okay. And saving it. All right. Cannot damage Wolverine for nothing. All right. I mean, I guess that's... <laughs> really how it works, right? Yeah. <laughs> well, and I get to place within one of him, so we'll just stand right I'll stand right on it. Okay. No, I guess it's gotta be within one, so Okay. All right. Got him. All right. So we're gonna go with cable. He's gonna spend two for his uh axe body spray sliding. <laughs> Uh, not quite within that point, unfortunately. Uh, but we're going into Venom with the, uh, <laughs> the plasma rifle. It is not worth the two dude, I'm rolls. <laughs> <laughs> dude, I'm, I'm sorry, dude. I was just laughing because <laughs> it's two, right? Yeah. All right. That's pretty good. All right. And Look at that. He's like, I'm going to take Venom out. There we go. Pretty good. Five of them? Five. Uh, saving nothing. Okay. Well, Venom takes five. Takes five. Uh, he would be incinerated, but because of Doc Ock, you can take that out. We got to do it again just to try and get Venom off the board. Yeah, that's... Uh... Wait, this is a new turn. Maybe. This is a new turn. That was Cyclops. I got him. Yeah, yeah. So I can't get the extra power. All right. Five days again. Oh, Ooh, all right. Another big one. Can daze him. Yeah, there we go. Uh, Five. I don't even think I can <laughs> match this. Save one, so it's taking four Venom's days. Okay. And he drops this. All right. Uh, so he's taking two? I've taken, actually, uh, seven that whole turn. Okay. So we'll get two onto Psylocke. She's within. Oh, no, she can only get one per turn, actually. So, All right. Um. And I'll go there. And that is cable done. Hmm. Yeah, it was pretty good. Cable's like, uh, you want to hurt? Yeah. <laughs> hurt his son? Exactly. Or hurt, hurt his father, I guess. Hurt his father. Yeah, I was going <laughs> to say, hurt his father. Um, all right. So I guess we're going to go with, uh, I'm going to go over here with um, Green Goblin. And we're going to, uh, before choosing the target, let me just pause this. Because right, I'm going to activate uh, Green Goblin. I'm going to spend four for Knight of the Goblin. I'm going to roll seven dice mm -hmm. going into Storm. I'm also going to choose that it's physical because Storm is a little bit more weak to physical. 
Um, and uh, he, if damage is dealt, she will get a condition. But let's see if I deal damage first. Uh, only him twice. Okay. Uh, room three. Uh, okay. I was going to say it was, it was black and one. one. <laughs> so damage is dealt. I will give her the incinerate condition. Okay. She takes one and is incinerated. Then we will do... They don't get any damage on that. So then we will do pumpkin bombs. And we will again choose physical. And um, yeah, hopefully get a wild on this. I uh, did get the wild hit three times. Okay. Uh, only rolling two dice down because of incinerate. I'm locking nothing. Right, so she'll take three, and I'll give her the bleed condition. Okay. And then Goblin will spend one and interact with the council and heal one. And Goblin's done. All right. <sighs> okay. Uh, we're going to go with Psylocke. <clears throat> uh, she is going to um, spend two to do her telekinetic combat enhancement. Uh, so she gets to advance short. Uh, she will pay to pick up the point there. Uh, and then... Well, before you do that? Yep. Oh, yep. Uh, three. Good. Got it. You haven't been moved one time. I uh, know, I haven't. <laughs> All right. Um, well, she's being, we're not phased by this. And unfortunately, she is not within range to really. Oh, no, she can do Kingpin. Okay. All right. So she's going to do her uh, Cybo into Kingpin. Okay. Uh, this is going to be Four Dice uh, Mystic. Four Dice Mystic. Mm -hmm. All right. So I'm on three dice. And crit. Pretty good. Three. Uh, saving two so far. Saving three? Okay. Uh, tr I did get the hit for pursuit, but I actually don't want to pursue. Uh, and she's going to use her second activation to uh, wherever my medium went. There it is. Um, oh, man. Cyclops is going to be blocking her. Or a cable can be blocking her. <laughs> she can get up oh, yeah. There. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She can just get up there. She can move back to uh, secure that point. Yeah, she's got the point. Alrighty. And because she did damage. Oh, no, she did not do damage. You saved all those. Okay. All right, I'm going to go with uh, Kingpin. Going to move him up here. It's small. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually beam into my beam does go across. Is it going across cable? Yeah, it is. Yeah. All right. So it goes across and I'm going to, so I'm going to do my beam attack, which is uh, the laser cane. This is going to be uh, four dice and this is energy and uh, does not benefit for cover. Okay. Uh, I'm going to spend two for uh, cable to use telekinetic shield. Okay. Uh, you're going to do Psylocke first? I'm going to go into Psylocke first. Okay. Yeah. So she's going to get five dice. And I hit twice. Okay. Uh, and blocking one. So it takes one. And then this will go right into uh, Cable. All right. You will also spend two to do Telekinetic Shield. Uh, hit twice. Save them all. Wow. <laughs> Pretty good. <laughs> You're like, I wish there was a hit. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and then I'm going to spend two for uh, street level negotiation because I should be within range two of this building. Yeah. Yep. Yep. I bumped him. Yeah. <laughs> um, so I'll spend two. We'll pick this up and throw it at Psylocke. Okay. So we'll just... Uh, All right, uh, three. Uh, one more crit. We have one more. One more dice too. But she's only rolling three. Yeah, but it's, 
It's four four damage coming in, but I'm oh, only blocking yeah. three. Oh, my yeah. bad, my bad. Yeah. That's right. You're right. So I'm blocking three, so she takes she one. She takes one. You're right. Yeah. My bad, dude. I was giving you an extra dice. <laughs> yeah. Was that nice of me? It was nice. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and then Kingpin is done. Okay. Oh, this actually goes on Venom. Or on Venom. All right. We're going to go with uh, Storm. Uh, she's going to, uh, first of all, pay one to interact with the mm -hmm. point to heal one damage. Uh, and then she's going to shake the bleed. Uh, actually, she's, right, she's going to hold off on that. She will do her um, lightning bolt into Green Goblin. Uh, she is going to spend two for Eye of the Storm. Uh, so this is going to make it a six dice energy. Goblin's only rolling three. Jeez, two. Mm. A lot of skulls. Yeah, take them. Okay. So I'm gonna any any. Uh, no, I did not get the wild, so there's no uh, conditions. And I'll get the extra power for. Get the extra power for. Uh, Doc Ock. Okay. And how many do you need to go down? Two. Two? Okay. Um, all right. She will spend... Um, she's going to spend uh, three to do Tempest, um, and she will throw this dumpster into... In the Goblin? Goblin. All right. So four, four dice... Uh, saving two of them, so it takes takes one. Takes one. All right. Um, and she's got to she's got to use her last activation to uh, lightning bolt again into Doc Ock or into Green yeah. Goblin. Uh, physical. Yeah. Uh, no, this is energy. Sorry. Okay. Try and take him out. She can do it unless she roll bad. That's pretty good so okay. far. All right, well, I gotta roll three of them. Come on, goblin. No. No. Okay. So that goblin will fall, and you get that. Well, you can do whatever you want with it. Um, she's not holding, so she will pick it up. Uh, how many you take from that? I took one. Took one. Okay, so she gets one for that. Um, and uh, it took four and it took four from her attacks. Yeah. Yeah. The first one. Yeah. Okay. Um, and then she will take one for bleed at the end of her activation. Okay. And that is storm. One roll and see if she moves. Oh yep. She does not. She does not. Does not move. All right. So um, you have Logan left. Yep. And I have Doc Ock. All right, guys. I, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to keep Doc Ock where he's at. I'm going to spend one power and I'm going to just heal him up. And. Uh, then he is just going to, I guess I'll move him just up here within one, and he's done. Okay. Um, and Logan's my last guy to go. He is going to, um, he's just going to do X slash into Rhino. Uh, it's going to be five dice physical. Uh, wild on a pierce. Or Pierce on a wild. Uh, nothing, just two. Um, saving one. Takes one. Okay. And gets an extra power for hitting him. One. And a little and aggressive. We'll go right next to you. Okay. <laughs> um, and then after the attack is resolved, we'll bring it to place within one. Pop on that point. And um, we're gonna do it again. That's all. all right. That's all Logan can really do, unfortunately. Five dice. Pearson Wild. Nah, one. Wow. Yeah. Takes okay. It. <laughs> he takes it at least. Wow. Jeez. And then how aggressive again? And this time, put him right there. Okay. Uh, Wolverine will heal 
for healing factor, then for his activation. And that is Wolverine done. Alrighty. All right, uh, so you had priority again. So what did you yep. score this time? Um, so we got uh, two senators and uh, two points because uh, yeah, Green Goblin dazed. is dazed. Yep. Uh, so that'll be four points. All right, one, two, three, four, ten. And I'm holding uh, two senators and just one point. So that's going to put me at ten. So we're tied right. up. Whew. Going into round four. We'll be back after the power up phase. All right, guys, we're back after you saw the score. It got tied up again in round four. Um, so I got priority on this one. So I'm going to play a card called Well Laid Plan. And basically that is Green Goblin and Doc Ock spend power each. And uh, then I roll five dice for people that are holding the tokens, which is going to be uh, Cyclock and Storm. If every crit and wild that I roll, they will take damage. And um, uh, each player may and it will drop the token. Result that's a uh, character damage. Here, read, read, read the drop part of it. Okay. Why I pay the power. All right. All right, guys. So technically, I have to move Doc Ock first. So I moved Doc Ock up first. Now he's within three. I'm playing well laid plan. I paid my power. So I'm going to roll five dice in the psych lock and hope for some crits and wild. Uh, did get one. Yep. So she's only going to take one. Okay. But she does drop her. She does drop the token. So I will then spend one from Doc Ock to pick it up and then roll my defensive dice. And hopefully I don't get moved. And I do get moved. Okay. So you get to move me, sir. Yep. He's coming up close and personal. <laughs> All right. And then what I will do is uh, then what's Cable have? He's got three left to flip. Uh, Cable has four left to flip. He's got and seven. And Cyclock has? Uh, three left. Three left? Maybe I just uh, try to take one of them out. Um, I'm going to use my beam on them. Okay. And I'm going to roll four dice against each one, which is going to give them the incinerate condition on the wild. Okay. Oh, uh, you know what? I'm going to I'm not. I'm going to do tentacle arms. Let's do this. I think I'm just going to move them. Move them out this way. Okay. Um, actually, guys, instead of moving him here, I'm actually moved him this way. Um, the idea behind that is if, because they, they have some, there's some beam attacks here. If he's going to beam attack from cable, he's got to go into Venom, and I'm okay with him going into Venom. And so he is going to be, Doc Ock's going to be done. Okay. All right. We're going to go with uh, Storm because she is not long for the oh, world. Wait, I got to do that first. Oh, wait, that's right. Yep. No before, before she does that. Before. So now uh, this is Green Goblin rolling the Storm. Uh, takes one. Okay. And is that enough to daze her? It is enough to daze her. All right. Uh, and we'll just put, well, you, I, oh, yeah, I placed the card. Yeah, you place it. Yeah. So I'm going to just place this. Uh, I should just put put it right here next to Goblin so you can pick that up again. Okay. And your turn. All right. So uh, we will go with uh, well, with Cable. Um, okay, yeah. So Cable is going to spend two to Body Slide. Actually, before he does that, uh, his first one, he's going to Plasma Rifle. Uh, it's going to go into Venom. Mm -hmm. Energy? Uh, yeah, five dice energy. So far, that's pretty good. Three? Nothing. Take okay. three. So, two, three... Is that powered up? All right. And then uh, he's going to spend two to body slide. Okay. And he's going to do his um, 
He's going to spend five to do his uh, area attack. All right. Uh, it's area two, so it'll be hitting Kingpin and Doc Ock. All right. Uh, <laughs> not, not, not Venom. Venom. <laughs> uh, this is going to be... It's, a good, <laughs> it's actually a good counter move to me moving him over there. <laughs> yeah. Uh, seven dice uh, Mystic. Mystic. Oh, yes. look at this guy. And the Kingpin. Where you, who are you going first? Uh, we'll go Kingpin first. Okay. Uh, and for each damage I deal, uh, I re remove damage from myself. Okay. Okay. Pretty bad. good. Not bad. Now these can't okay. argue with over fifty percent right, yeah. right there. Uh, saving nothing. Okay, Take five. Take five, and I will move the three for myself. And I'll get an extra power from Doc Ock. Yep, and then into uh, Doc Ock. Uh, so three. Save one. So okay. takes two. Takes two. All right, and that's cable done. All right, interesting. Now this is interesting. This is interesting, man. All right, guys. So I'm gonna activate Kingpin because I feel like if I don't. He's got two. He's gonna gonna go down. So I'm gonna move him. I don't think I can get within the point though. Yeah, I'm still outside that point. Uh, and then I'm gonna spend three for the uh, hail to the king, which is basically gonna be seven dice. Before damage is done, I'm gonna take her and throw her short, which will go into this. So she's gonna take a damage from that. Okay. And I'm at seven, seven dice. Uh, this is going to be seven physical. So within two, sorry, I'm going to do martial artist. Uh, that was a pretty good roll, dude. That was a really good roll. Oof. I guess if I'm going to spike, I'm going to. Yeah, I guess so. Jeez. Spike, <laughs> spike hard. So we have uh, eight of them. Okay. Uh, so there's really no way I can even, even if I save on all of them, uh, which I do. Uh, she's still taking four, and she oh, will yeah. go down. All right. That was pretty good by Kingpin. It was good. I cannot move him anyway, so Kingpin is now done. Okay. Um, all we got left is Logan, unfortunately, because everyone else is dazed. Um, and I have Venom, Green Goblin, and Rhino left. Yeah. All right. So uh, Logan's the only one left on my team standing still uh, that hasn't gone. So we're going to move him. Uh, coming off this point, unfortunately. To get there. <laughs> uh, and he is easily within three now to do his X slash into um, Kingpin. Kingpin. Um, and in fact, you know what? We're going to pay uh, the four for Tornado uh, Claw. Tornado Claw. It is a beam. Um, unfortunately, it's only being hitting ten pin, but I want the extra dice to try and take him out. There's more dice. Yeah. Just throw more dice. Uh, so this is seven dice physical. All right. Uh, it does have a bleed and pierce on wild. Uh, wow. Two. But I do get the pierce at least. And so let me explode one of these. So you're gonna pierce, pierce down the one. All right. Uh, so and you're blocking the one, so yep. you're fine. No, I got. I'll take one. Oh, you take one. Okay. Yeah, I rolled. Um, you hit twice, right? Yeah. Yeah, I took. I blocked two. Oh, okay, and then pierce. pierce okay. All right, and he is bleeding. That's enough to get him, actually. Oh, nice. Okay, sweet. Uh, five, six. Oh no, I'm sorry. That's only six. Okay, uh, I apologize. Um, but I do get to place within one of you. So. And you said uh, he's bleeding as well. Yeah, bleeding as well. All right. And then uh, I'm going to just shake that with... Oh, I don't think I can shake bleed. Nope, shock's going slow. Okay. All right, so... And I'm going to take the extra power for Doc Ock. Okay. Um, and he moved, so that's unfortunately all Logan can do. Um, so, yeah. But he did get to place, so he's within that point at least. All right. I got to think about this first. Yeah. All right, guys, so uh, I'm just going to 
move Venom back here to cover this objective. Um, and I don't need to move anybody else because that's going to actually give me 16 points because Goblin can actually pick this up yep. for 17 points because uh, that's going to be, I'm going to hold all three Senators without without moving Goblin. I'll pick that up because you can move, you can move back. That's going to be, uh, so I have priority, you have priority. Uh, you had priority this round. All right, so I have one, two, three, and four senators, which puts me at seventeen. And you have. Uh, uh, no I just senators. have the one point. Yeah, I have no senators in the one point. Yeah, and it's eleven. So without with just finishing the game off without having to go through and seeing everything move, that's how the game played out. Uh, they hit hard, man. Yeah. Spider foes hit hard. Now again, I spiked. I spiked too. Yeah, losing Cyclops early. That was, pretty big. That, was that was horrible. And then losing Cy uh, Psylocke there with uh, the big spike from Kinpin. Exactly. Sometimes bad spikes happen, and then yeah. man, some. And when you whiff, you whiff <laughs> in this game. Like when you have heavy hitters, I noticed, Kevin. When you have heavy hitters, when you whiff, the whiff is big. Oh yeah, it's big. Yeah. Like you have to, you yeah. have to be able to hit a lot, right? You know what I mean, or consistently hit. Yeah. Because, dude, it's like, but I guess you make up for it. Like, he, King, Kingpin whiffs early in the game. Then I also, I spike. Yeah. And, and nice, you know, Venom whiffs. Then I spike. You know what I mean? So. Yeah, it balances out. It balances out. And I, and actually, uh, Cable spiked too one. Yeah. Yeah, he did. And he yeah. spiked once. But, uh, yeah. Yeah. So that was a pretty good game, man. I, I don't know. It was pretty good. I know you just got your, your cable painted up. We're going to talk a little bit more about uh, X Men. Um, here in uh, episode of Dice Club coming up. But, uh, yeah, it was a fun game, Kevin. Thanks Thank you. Thanks on. for having me, man. Oh, man, always. It's always fun to play with you. And, uh, yeah, we'll be back in, uh, next time. God bless and peace out.